152. About to take off. We'll see you in a little bit, Key West. We made it. We made it. The new keys. First order of business now that we're in the keys. Fun boat. I don't know where it's at. So we're in a BMW right now? What the heck is this thing? It's like a spaceship. It's that new technology. All right, guys, we're here, Key West, back again. As you can tell, we got some flags flying. Uh, the crew went nine for 14 or nine for 13 today. Uh, we didn't get to make it. We got here late, but we're here, Viking Key West Challenge. Glad to be a part of it, 56 boats. Uh, it's gonna be fun. Clark, or Clark's not here today. He's got school, he can't miss, we're here, today's Wednesday. Clark can't miss all that school, but it's all right. Sarah and Dalton may show up. Friday, fish Saturday, but we'll see. But we're here, glad to be here, and we'll see what happens. They did pretty good today. It's supposed to, it may rain tomorrow, I don't know, but we'll see. It's hot. I'm gonna get inside, start rigging up some stuff, and getting ready. We got a bunch of bait. Y'all get ready. We have our 55 Valhalla, and we have our 68 convertible, and 53 owners votes fishing the tournament. So it's a great turnout. To give everybody a great applause. Another great turnout. Hi right, guys. Just went over the captain's meeting. Did all that stuff. There's 8:30 to 3:30. That's the fishing hours. We got Thursday tomorrow to fish. We're gonna leave pretty early. I don't know exactly where we're going, but we're gonna get up early, get to a spot, put the sonar down, search a little bit, see where they're at. And then when lines, kind of put lines in, we'll have a better idea where they're at. <clears throat> but Friday is a lay day, uh, poker run, uh, kids, kids tournament thing they're gonna do on the dock somewhere. And then Saturday we fish again, so. It's gonna be fun. We got Chip, y'all know my boy Chip, Jack, Miguel, Noah behind the camera, myself, Juan, another mate, and then Friday night we may have Sarah and Dalton, one of my friends Dalton. They may show up just depending on if they can make it or not, but it's gonna be fun. I mean, what is that? Nine, nine for, nine for 13 or 14. I for, they still haven't told me. They just said they caught nine. But uh, they had a, they had six hook at one time, a six banger. That, which means every rod we had in, or they had in the chair today was hooked up. They caught four out of the six. So, I mean, they only had two people or three people. So they did good, but we're gonna fly the drone, get some shots of all the Vikings. This is a Viking only tournament. So we got a Valhalla right here. We got the new Vikings here, the new Bay Boat. I think it's a 29, I believe. The new 55 Valhalla and the new 66 or something like that convertible. So we're gonna get ready. Fly the drone out, get some good shots, and we'll probably see y'all in the morning. And go for it. All right, guys, it is 
8.38, we're just chilling out, seeing all everybody, checking out boats, so, uh, like I said, it's the Viking only tournament, it's called the Viking Challenge, uh, 56 boats, there's, uh, I'm not sure how much money's in it, but, we got a boat right over there. You probably can only see the red, but it's got seven flags up. So technically, if we were fishing today, we'd be in the lead. We got nine, but we're not. We didn't fish today, but we uh be all right tomorrow. We got a good spot, we think. Hopefully, pays out, but never know. Fish, fish don't sleep right there. They're gonna, they'll probably be back because there's bait and stuff there, but they like to move, go find more bait. They're going around the Gulf Stream, moving around. So we'll see what happens. May go out there, smash them. May go out there and catch three. And Don't say that. huh? Don't say that. Don't you never that. know. Knock on wood, but I got a good feeling. Probably gonna go out there. Depend really depends on the weather. It's supposed to a cold front supposed to blow through tonight, and it's gonna be like I don't know, 45 mile per hour wind, and then lighten up in the morning, but. Who knows? It could freaking, like, I'm sure y'all check y'all's weather sometime and it says freaking 100% rain. At 12 o'clock, you go out at 12 o'clock and it's sunshine and rainbows. So it just, we'll see what happens, but I'm excited. We're all excited. There's some big boats here. There's a 92 right behind us. Uh, there's another 92 somewhere that way. Uh, some 80s. But oh, 66 gunslinger is gonna do the job. Hopefully, hopefully top three. Hopefully first, really. But we'll be fine with top three. Be another podium. But yeah, it's gonna be fun. We're rigged up. We got our same setup. Kites, two kites. Right behind the boat, we got our bait already in the water. And then. In the morning, we'll show you, but there's a live well on the, or actually later, you'll see it in a little bit. Right in the cockpit, we have a little live well with a, a herrings. And those is goggle eyes, but we got herrings in there. But it's gonna be fun. I'm excited, super excited. 8.30 lines in, 3.30 lines out. If we're hooked up at 20, uh, 259, we have to call in and let them know that we're hooked up. But yeah, it's gonna be fun. Y'all get ready. It's gonna be super fun. But if y'all are excited, fishing's back, and sailfish are biting, blue marlin are biting, everything's biting right now. If y'all are excited that we're back in the fishing videos, hit the thumbs up button for us. We really appreciate it. And you know, if you're really excited, hit the little subscribe button. We appreciate it. But yeah, we're, uh, we're gonna hang out, go downstairs, go to sleep, and then we've got a big, ba big day tomorrow. Big day. Big day tomorrow. So y'all get ready. We'll see y'all in the morning. Go for it. One more thing. If y'all aren't caught up to date, and y'all haven't seen it, y'all are new to the channel and y'all are watching our videos. We went to the Bahamas a while back. We got third place. This is, will be our second tournament of the year. Looking for podium, but we'll have another tournament in the Bahamas in, we're in the first week of April, but the end of April. And then 
Our first golf tournament will be May, I think, 17th or something like that. I'll pull it up for y'all real quick. May 15th, or 16th, one day off. May 16th is our first golf tournament. June, y'all be ready for June. Y'all want to see some real freaking tournament content? Get ready. Because this is our dates. So, Biloxi is the 5th through the 8th, or 5th through the 9th, actually. Then we got Big Rock up in the Carolinas, OBX, uh, which is uh, the 10th through the 15th. And then, I don't know what's happening girls are asking us questions or saying hi guys to every guy on the dock weird but anyways uh, Emerald Coast our favorite our hometown the 19th through the 23rd then we got Bay Point a Panama City tournament that we didn't fish last year it's new or it's not new but it's new because it's a new tournament now it just came back they just redid it. They just started to do it again. But that's the 26th through the 29th. So June is freaking stacked. July, we got one or two tournaments. The Blue Marlin Grand Championship, of course. And then August, we got like two or three we're going to do. But y'all get ready. It's going to be a, a hectic freaking summer. I hope y'all are ready. Cause I'm freaking ready, but I don't even I I don't even know how many I counted right there, how many I said, but let me know down in the comments how many you think we're gonna win out of whatever I said. Uh, hopefully we win the triple crown this year in the golf. We'll see what happens, you know. You never know, but we got a good team, and we'll see what happens, but. First objective, a turkey. There's a turkey. There's a turkey. That's what we should be doing uh, soon. Maybe not me, but Clark should be doing some turkey videos. But our first objective, win this tournament, you know. Win the Viking Key West Challenge. So we'll catch you all in the morning. Time to fish. We just had one right here. Uh, Wahoo clipped us off, but literally just had one right here. Uh, but we're fishing, so we haven't even got all our lines in, so I'm gonna help get it lines in and hopefully read some sailfish real quick. But everybody's fishing, so game time, baby. All right, guys, making a move. Had that bite and been here for an hour. Haven't caught nothing else or seen anything else. I boat over there tripled up, but we're gonna make a move. Go back to the spot they fished yesterday. See what happens.
We'll see y'all over there. All right, guys, we're at the new spot. Less boats, they're all off in the distance over there, but we're gonna get these lines in and start fishing. Maybe get some good third place juju. Get us the first this time. But yeah, we'll let y'all know what happens. Almost an hour and 30 minutes. Came over to this new spot, pulled up. Haven't had a bite yet, but we just heard someone caught a six banger at the sea buoy, but we looked at the app. It hasn't been updated, so we don't know if that's that it's true or not, but we'll see here in a little bit. But first place is four. Uh, second place is two. Third place is two. So everybody else has one. So we'll see. We get a six banger or in the lead. Or tied, whatever it is, but we'll see what happens. We got till three thirty, so we all right. I think the sun's about to start poking through the clouds, so we'll see what happens. Y'all get ready. Stay here for a little bit. Keep driving for a couple minutes. All the fish shut off everywhere, like a light. I mean, literally. Bo had the six banger, uh, a triple, a quad. Now it's been 45 minutes and no one's caught a fish. So we're gonna hang out here for a little bit, see what happens. All right, guys, making a move. Uh, nothing there. It shut off. Everybody, been like five fish caught, all different boats. So, I don't know. We're going to make a move. Heading, which way are we going? East? We're going to go try up there. Uh, trying to find them. People have been picking them apart. They've been, what's happening is everybody's been finding these big groups. And they've been just catching the group, so. Hopefully we'll find a big group of them, big wad, and catch a six banger. That's what we need. But we'll see y'all over there. Alright, well, as y'all just saw, King Mackle, uh, also known as Kingfish, but caught something right now. Uh, I, think there's a, I think there's a Kingfish category, I'm not sure, but we got a bite finally. And I actually brought one to the boat, but we'll see what happens here. I'm gonna get these lines back up. And hopefully get a sailfish here soon. All right, it's 12.50. Hooked up to something. Bonita or something. Well, we had a, just had a tuna. And the barracuda that they're talking about just ate the back of it, so that's a disqualification to weigh in. So that that won't count. About to be lunch. Or actually, it is lunch. It's about to be past lunch. Uh, 
yeah, we're just gonna keep on fishing. Hopefully we'll find a group and run over them and get a six banger, catch it back up. I think we need, I think we need six to get, to get second place right now. We'll see, we'll keep all updated. We're at our new location. We're gonna try it here. Just got line, lines in. We got too much time we got left. A little, a little under two hours. We'll see what happens. We just need at least, we need at least three today, just so we can. First place is 900, so. Three today, six banger tomorrow. You know, we just need at least at least a couple today. That'll be all right. But we'll see what happens. Uh, never know. God may have us stored out for tomorrow for a hundred. You don't know. Oh, we'll see. We'll, we'll see what happens. It's a it's a good day. Catching fish. I got a king mackerel and a tuna. You're either about to see the next slide, some B-roll, or us hooked up. So, see you then. Y'all saw that? Release number one for us. We need uh, six more now. Get up to third place, but one come up, two come up right here. We need all three. Could have been the same fish, but our short and our mid got slammed. Came over here at our middle, but we got one, so that's good. Uh, it's a jumper, but now we just need the six back here. All right, well, another big black fin. It'll uh, maybe put us in the tuna category, but we'll see. Still waiting for that sailfish to come on. Less than one hour. We got about 54 minutes. So we'll see what happens. Y'all get ready. Might get that three banger real quick. Another bonita. Uh, 3.30, lines out. Heading back to the marina. Not what we wanted today, but at least we got one. Yeah, one for three. Not what you want, but 
we left earlier and they caught five there, went five for eight. Just like everywhere we leave, someone catches a fish, so I don't know. We'll see y'all back at the marina. Got our kingfish, it weighed in like 14 or 13 pounds or something like that, 12 pounds, I don't know. But we got a, it's not gonna hold up. There's a bunch of more fish getting weighed in, but weigh in points is points. The tuna weighed in like, I think it was 14 pounds. It's not gonna hold up or anything. It's not anything giant, but you, know, you gotta weigh in what you catch. So we got our kingfish. It's day two of the week we're here, but we fished today. Y'all didn't, that'll be a different video, but we fished today, caught two sails and a nice wahoo, but we got Dalton here, Sarah's here now. They're gonna help us uh, catch some fish tomorrow, hopefully, but we gotta have a big, big day tomorrow if we wanna catch back up. I think, like I said, it's like first place is like 970 points, so we gotta, Big, big day ahead of us tomorrow. We uh, we think we found a spot, but never know. We gotta check the charts and everything. Tomorrow, tonight, weather may come in or something and freaking change everything around. So we'll see, but if we can do it, it'll be awesome. But Dalton's gonna- work to do. Yeah. Dalton's gonna be the first person up tomorrow. It'll be his first billfish and then we're throwing him in here. <laughs> uh. Nah, we can't. We'll throw them offshore and then pick them back up or something because uh, there's some big old sharks in here. That would not be good for the video. <laughs> that would not be good. But we're going to uh, hang out, go to this dinner thing they're going to have or something like that. I think we got to rig up some stuff too later. But we'll see you all in the morning, bright and early. See ya. Good morning guys, day two of the tournament, which is day three for us, but yesterday we went and caught some sales, we caught two, big day ahead of us. We're leaving, it's 7.15, I don't, we're not running that far, we gotta have a big, big day today. We gotta have at least like 10 sales, but it's gonna be fun, it's gonna be hectic if we go catch 10, but y'all get ready. Hit the thumbs up button and comment down below if you think we're going to catch back up. But that's a big old boat. But we'll see y'all out there. Well, we're here. Putting the kites up. Putting the kites up. Uh, what time is it, Dalton? All right, so we got nine minutes to lines in. Like I said, we gotta have a big day today. We'll see how it happens. Eating lucky breakfast. That Valhalla right there. They have seven sailfish uh, from Thursday. I think they're sitting second place or something like that. So, is this where we were yesterday? No, we we're about eight miles farther down the road. Okay, but we'll see what happens. Y'all get ready. Pick y'all back up when it's time to fish. Eight thirty-four. Got lines in. Got this kite stretched out. Lines in. Got one here. Vixen, something over here. I think a swivel, but 
yeah, we're fishing now. Uh, I need a six banger to come by. That's all I can say. But gotta have a big, big day today. So we'll see what happens, and we'll pick y'all back up when we get our first bite. Big King or Wahoo just destroy our long bait, but literally Dalton was reeling right to the boat and pulled hook, but it's all right. Looking for those sails anyways. Uh, we moved a little. We just came offshore a little, some nicer water, but it's been about an hour, 10 minutes, 941. We're uh, still looking for our sail. Caught a big hound fish. Is that good there? Hopefully we get them right here. Got some nicer water. We'll see what happens. A boat caught three, another boat caught two, and some other boats caught one. So we gotta get this freaking double, it's triple. Quadruple, pick y'all back up here in a minute. All right, we're moving, making a run. I'm gonna go to the east boundary, the eastern boundary. See, there's some boats there, but you're good. But we're gonna see what happens over there. I don't know. All right, we just pulled up to the next spot, just threw the kites out. Um, about to get some lines out. Hopefully, he gets lucky over here. Uh, there, there's no wind, so I'm gonna go. We're about to go offshore a little, get in some uh, bluer water. I, you can't tell unless you got these polarized glasses on, but if you look. There's like kind of like a line right here. You probably can't see it that good in the camera, but there's a green line in the water. We're in the green water. This green water just came in and it's heading offshore. So we're gonna go out there a little, try to get in the, try to get out there. But a boat caught five. So they're, they're in first, they caught five the first day, but they haven't had nothing. So, I mean, we're, we're still in this. It's not a, we're not a, we still got like five hours or something like that. We just got to have a group come by. We're going to head west and offshore a little. Hopefully find them. Right now, this is about the most east you could go for the tournament. I think, uh, you can keep going. I think we're like 28 miles or something like that from the marina. You can only go 35. Oh, 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 back up, back up. Oh. The kite just broke off. I don't know what's going on. That's the second time our kites broke. I don't know what's going on. The first one, the swivel broke. That one, it just broke off. I'm guessing one of the knots broke too. We're gonna head west offshore, so we'll see y'all over there. All right, it's 11 o'clock. We got four hours and 30 minutes, but we just got to the next spot. You can see there's there's a pretty good show of boats right there. We're kind of, we're east of them. We're gonna have to do only two lines on each uh, kite because there's no wind completely gone away we'll see what happens but we need some fish now fish if you can hear me we need them now but struggle's real everybody all the boats really that's caught a fish hasn't seen anything else so the boat that caught five they just got those five and they haven't seen any or caught another one so 
I don't know. Everybody's just picking one. So we just... Oh, right here, right here, right here! Freaking skyrocketed on that thing. Holy. Nah, I just saw the giant splash. Freaking Wahoo right here just skyrocketed. Holy crap. But yeah, we got action. Well, we need some fish. Wahoo, that counts. It'll uh, get us some points, but I don't know how big that one was. I just watched a freaking giant splash. But we're going to get the lines out and then hopefully catch this fish. Y'all get ready. I think it's pretty slow for everybody right now. All these boats, no one's got one. We just had a big king mackerel, or not big, a king mackerel come up, come up and skyrocket on our dang long. But something's on our middle right here. But we just picked up freaking grass. It ran right in the grass to hide. Uh, let's see, we might get eight right here. We saw a free jumper. As soon as we pulled up and got our lines in, as soon as I stopped talking to y'all, a free jumper came up and we moved over here a little. But yeah, we need the fish. It's hot. No wind, no current, blazing hot. Conditions for kite fishing. That dude just hooked up on a free jumper. He just, just pulled up. We'll get here one shortly just need not one a group All right, well, you yeah, probably just saw a little glimpse of a wahoo, but there was three that freaking came right behind the boat. I've never seen wahoo do that, but they were, I mean, right there. One was a nice one, uh, but we didn't. We hooked one, but they're we don't have. We have freaking super light leader, so I mean, they cut right through it, but. We're gonna move. It's 107. I think we're gonna go closer to Key West, the point, catch some sails. I mean, at this point, it's really just can we just catch some just to have them? Get Dalton his first one, let Sarah reel on some, and uh, get some good footage. But I mean, a six banger put us back, so I don't know. We'll see what happens. Miguel just said he saw a free jumper. We've seen a, a couple free jumpers. One boat caught one, but boats are, they don't know what to do right now. Boats are moving, trying to find where they're at, but it's just so freaking hot and slow today. We'll see how the next spot, though.
All right, well, we got some little action. Freaking little Bonita. Uh, yeah, not what we want, but we're about to pick the lines up and then go somewhere over there. I don't know where. It's 2.14. We got an hour and 17 minutes left. Really an hour and 16. An hour and 16. But let's see what happens. Dalton's got a huge arm pump. Your arm tired? Yeah. But, yeah, we'll see y'all the next spot. Dalton just caught a blackfin tuna. We uh, we got like I think 50 minutes, 48 minutes, something like that. But we're in the heart of all the boats. A bunch of boats around us. A bunch of kites flying. So we'll see what happens. May fly the drone up. I don't know. Not a good day. It's hot, slow. So struggles real, but. We'll see what happens in the next 40 minutes. Just caught a nicer blackfin. Uh, I, I doubt it's gonna place. It's gonna. It's gonna. It may place third or something, but I don't know. I didn't really get a good look at him. But yeah, we're. Uh, I think we're. Three fourteen. Yeah, we're. Fifteen minutes. Yeah. Thirty-five Sixteen minutes away. So we'll see what happens. But. Yeah, he's a little bigger. Yeah, he's bigger than the one we caught the first day, I think. Well, it was a good day. It was fun, but we're going home. <laughs> Empty handed. Well, we got Bonita. No. Uh, Blackfin. It was fun. A bunch of people caught some fish, but uh, not a bunch. Thank you for bringing me on this trip. It's been fun. It's been very fun. Dalton caught a bunch of Blackfin. Uh, caught a, a Bonita. Uh, Missed some wahoos, saw some wahoos, pretty cool. Uh, oh yeah, we're heading back to the marina, we'll see you back there. All right guys, we just weighed the fish in. Take a guess on the biggest tuna today. Give you a second. Comment down below. Okay, if you guess 17 pounds, you were correct. Or if you guess 17.9, you were correct. I think, right? 17.9, right? The next, the smaller one, nine or 10.4. So if you if you got that right, congrats. But yeah, uh, fun week. Had fun. Caught some sales. 
even though they weren't a bunch in the tournament, but still fun catching some sails. Had fun with everybody. Too bad Dalton didn't catch his first, but we'll be fishing in back home in the Gulf soon, so we'll catch a big blue marlin. But yeah, we're gonna enjoy the night. They got an awards. We'll probably get a little footage of that, but yeah, it was fun. I think we'll end up with maybe around 200 points from the meat fish and stuff, but it was fun. So we'll probably do a outro after the dinner. So we'll see y'all later. Got done with the dinner and the awards. Uh, congratulations to uh, first choice. Let me make sure that's right. I think that's what it's called. First choice and the crew. They caught 11 sails and some other meat fish. 71 pounds worth of meat. But congratulations to them and Salt Shaker. Congrats. Uh, their kid, uh, Piper, she got Lady Angler, Top Angler, I think uh, one more. But that's awesome. Congratulations to that. Right choice. My bad. Bad Fish and Magic Hour. Congratulations to them. But yeah, it was a fun trip. Not what we wanted, though. It's all right. Uh, next week, you'll see in a... In a couple videos later on but next week we're going out in the Gulf we'll be in the Gulf for next week the week after that then we go back to Chub K and then we go back to uh, the Gulf for one more practice uh, trip and then Orange Beach so that'll be our first golf tournament is Orange Beach so we're at two tournaments so far one for one it's pretty good so far we got Chub K and then Orange Beach, and then they keep on going. But if you like the video, hit the thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button, turn on the little bell right there, click, click it, and then we'll see you in the next one. See you.